BBC Radio Suffolk. A newly founded music group is promoting recovery through therapy in Ipswich. Foxhall Music Group takes its name from Foxhall House. That's a unit for men with mental health issues. Chris Price, who works there as a clinical support worker, decided to put his degree in music production to good use and appealing for help from music production companies has been raising funds to buy equipment to be used alongside his own to set up this facility. Well, I spoke to Chris earlier today to find out more. I've been working on Foxhall House now for about a year um, as a clinical support worker. Um, I'm through sort of engaging with, with the service users and trying to come up with sort of different ideas to promote their recovery. Um, we thought it would be really good to to sort of start doing some music. Um, some of the service users expressed their interest in, in sort of creating and, and writing their own music um, and with myself having a degree in music production, I thought that that's something that we could we could sort of work towards. So, excellent. So, when do the group meet, and what sort of things are you getting up to? So we we started around February March time of this year, and we just started with like a basic laptop, basic karaoke microphone, um, and initially it was just kind of service users rapping over the top of of sort of beats that, that we had downloaded from the internet um, and then that sort of evolved into making our own music um, and sort of getting a little bit more creative as we got more equipment we were able to then you know focus more on the musical aspect of things and, and making our own beats and making our own songs and things like that so we're currently meeting every Monday night um, and we're we're just kind of having fun <laughs> And what sort of feedback have you had from those taking part? The service users really enjoy it. They they really enjoy it and they really find it beneficial. Um, it can be hard in mental health, especially as an inpatient, you know, to speak about how you're feeling and, and to open up to people. But we're finding that through music and and through that sort of creativity side of things, that service users are feeling a lot more comfortable to open up about things and and it really seems to be lifting their mood and helping them. You need a bit of help, though, don't you, from from outside? Yeah, you do, yeah. I, I can't do it all on my own. Um, so what i done was I signed up to swim a mile-long open water swim in Alton Water in June, for which I raised nearly £500. Um, I'd never really done swimming before, um, so it was a little bit of a test for me and, and obviously raised money for a really good cause. Um, I also reached out to to sort of music production companies and my old university lecturer, and we were really lucky to have some positive feedback from them, and we had sort of donations of of hardware and software to sort of enable the group to move forward and grow. So how would you like to see things develop, Chris? I think what we want to do as a unit on Foxhall House, we we want to make our own sort of track promoting what we do, um, get as many people involved in that as possible, whether that be staff, service users, just get everyone involved, make our own sort of full-length track, make a little video to accompany that, and then I kind of, you know, I want to help other units and wards as well, so if there's sort of interest there in other areas. I would maybe like to sort of see what we could do in other areas as well. Keep up the good work, Chris. I'm sure you will. That's uh, Chris Price uh, talking to me earlier this afternoon. (laughs) 